Hey everyone, welcome back. I am very, very excited to share with you this extremely delicious recipe. It's called potato crusted tilapia. Well, you can use any type of fish. It is quick, easy, and not that expensive at all. And let's get started with the ingredients. You'll need one half cup of low fat buttermilk, one teaspoon of minced garlic, one four teaspoon of salt and pepper. And with the fish, you can actually pick any type of fish that you want, but you need one and a half pounds of it and one package of two ounce dehydrated potatoes and three tablespoons of butter. Okay, so we're gonna get started by taking our garlic and you're just gonna mince that and measure about one teaspoon of it. You can use a slap chop like we did or if you have a mincer, that's fine too. If you just wanna chop it with your knives, that's fine too. But just get one tablespoon and you're gonna take your bowl and you're gonna dump it in there. And then you're gonna take your half a cup of low fat buttermilk. Add in 1 4 teaspoon of salt and 1 4 teaspoon of ground pepper and you're actually going to mix all the ingredients together. And we actually decided to add brown rice to our meal. So if you're going to do that, I would get your rice ready because it is going to take about an hour to cook all the way through. So we did rinse our rice twice and you're just going to stick it in your rice cooker and let that cook for about an hour. And since we did buy our fish frozen, we're going to be put ours in a warm bowl so they thaw it out a little bit. And so we just washed our fish, put ours in a pan like that, and at each layer of fish we put a about a spoonful or two of the sauce over it. So it kind of like sautés it and you're going to um, let that sauté for about three to four minutes or even longer if you want. If you decide you want vegetable in this, you need any type of vegetable, lemon pepper, and butter and while the fish is set to the side for a little bit take your any type of vegetable um, we decided to go with broccoli as you can see and just chop that up and when you're done cutting your vegetable you can actually choose any way that you want to cook your vegetables we decided to try a new method by putting olive oil in, put your broccoli, and put a little bit of water in there so it kind of steams up a little bit, but it kind of came out a little bit overcooked, but that was okay, it was still delicious. While the rice is cooking and the broccoli is cooking, now take the pan that you're going to use to cook the fish, put it in medium high, and put butter over that so it melts a little bit, and then take your dehydrated potato flakes and put that on the plate and slap your fish over that so it kind of coats it all over. Make sure you press firmly on both sides so you coat it real good. And now take your fish and put it on your preheated pan. And just check on your fish once in a while, but we did put ours for about four minutes until the bottom is golden brown. But don't flip it yet because when the four minutes is up, um, you're gonna flip it over and then put new butter in. And it, that's what it should look like. While the other side of the fish is cooking, take about a tablespoon of butter into the bowl that you're going to serve your vegetable in. And before we put the vegetable into our bowl, we sprinkled lemon pepper on top of it. And you're going to serve it on your dish. And now check on your rice. Mmm, yummy! And that is the final product. Hope you like it. Thank you for watching and hopefully you'll give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to check out our second channel that Malaya is looking at on the right. And on the left is our last video. We did the whole yum chicken. Thank you and have a great day.